Well, we've broken the school record. We have broken individual records uh, with Kara breaking the goal scoring record and total points record. Um, we've had some ups and downs recently with injury, but the team has rallied around each other and we're confident, you know, that we have enough depth to be able to pull together as a team. Yeah, it happened actually funny enough after our Mitchell game, which we outshot them, I don't know, maybe 24 to four and lost two to one. And um, you know, we had a coming out party where we talked about some areas where we need to be more positive with the way we speak to each other, you know, things like that. And ever since then, attitudes have been great. Uh, you know, we've rallied around each other. We understand it's a team game. It's not an individual game. So from that game, we went 5 nothing against Regis, 7-1 against Newberry, 5 nothing against Curry. We haven't lost since, actually. We've had a couple ties in there. But uh, that was probably the turning point. So we have some good players back there. We have three freshmen in the back line, which is always a little scary, because uh, you know they're going to learn through experience and making some mistakes. But they've just been playing together well as a unit. And we have a freshman goalkeeper who's kind of learning on the fly, but you know she does some really nice things. She comes off her line really well, and if we learn to stay high, drop as a team, you know, move at a collective hole with the back four and the keeper, uh, we're difficult to score against. But it's not just those five; it's really the whole collective eleven. We understand defending starts from our forwards. Um, you know, everybody works hard to press the ball in certain areas and win it back. We understand that it's not an individual game. You know, it's not the coaching staff, it's not our forwards, it's not our goalkeepers, it's everyone. It's a collective family and a collective unit uh, that's working hopefully as one. And when we work as one, it doesn't guarantee success, but it guarantees you know, that we will do things as a team, uh, both defending, attacking, you know, everything's done as a unit. And when, when you play like that, it makes you know, hard to score against because you're playing against 11 players rather than one. And when you when you uh, when you play like that offensively, you're attacking with 11 players rather than one. Even our goalkeepers involved. What has exceeded my expectations is this week. Uh, well, really the whole year, but this week especially, losing those two, we hit a real low. But we came up probably higher than we've ever been and we're trusting in each other we're trusting in God to bring us through this we know we have depth and one thing we have to understand is we'll start eight freshmen today but they're all ready and they're all ready to pick up the pieces and that that's unusual so I'd say that is far exceeded my expectations do not contain go in and pressure okay win 50 50 balls all right let's go. one two 